and we got big swim bait rods with straight braid and we're gonna go out and target these fish on really big baits it should be awesome you pumped? I'm pumped. I'm excited. This guy I'm loves excited. to throw those big baits. I know he does. Yeah, he does I mean, it all you the time. might catch them better than I do because you got some flipping and other stuff rigged up. I've got a I've got a big smash tech convict and I got an eight inch hood. That's all, <laughs> That's all you got. That's all he brought. Probably going to be whacking them if I have to change. <laughs> so you guys stay tuned, man. It should be an awesome day. I know I'm Jack. He's Jack. Hope you're Jack. It's Thanksgiving Day. Yeah, man. What are we doing? <laughs> Fishing is life, and we mean it. We mean it when we say it freaking ready man i'm ready i got my sausage mcgriddles sausage mcgriddle i got my big coat let's go Bro, what's our weight goal today for best five what's our goal oh 25 25 last time we set out for 20 but we actually with me and mike we got right I mean, it was right at 20 it was probably 20 on the nose maybe 21 at most andrew caught it we got a goal of 25 pounds today I'm gonna be honest with you, I wouldn't really be all that surprised if it went higher than that. No, we you can pop 30 out here pretty pretty easy if they're biting. But, they're biting them big baits but, like that, yeah. But they're, you know, we don't have great conditions for it. So we're gonna have bluebird skies again, and the, the big kicker is, is no wind. We've got just a very, very, very light southeast wind today. So we're really hoping for some wind, but you can get it. But man, there's so many fish up there, they were biting to me the other day. We'll get them. We're gonna get them, what do you think? Good fish right here. Let me give her a drink and give me a picture, bud. We'll we do the best we can. We're gonna get them. He can say, We're gonna get them. Y'all watch out. have the camera running yet or anything Andrew just flipped the bait right there just to check his bait and make sure it was running true and one tried to bite it it was insane holy crap it's fixing to happen Trying to be real quiet in this area, but you guys just saw the same kind of same thing as the other day. I hooked that fish way out there, and he felt pretty good, but he got wrapped around one of those pad stems, and I lost him. Um, he hit the convict twice. He hit the convict twice, and I threw that jig in there, kind of similar to what we did the other day a couple times. You guys saw it happen. There it is, stuck in the top of his dome piece. Look at that. That is a smash tech convict right there. That's a bad bait, ain't it, buddy? Yeah, man. That's a great weedless. It, it's got to be the best big profile weedless swim bait. It's got to be. Yeah. Big old 10 aught owner beast hook. Look what we got going on here. You guys saw it the other day. They're in here chasing this bait and they're eating. They're eating big gizzard chat in here. And, uh, you know, he. He ate it, hit it hard. That's two quick ones punching. You know, we kind of, I rigged this up because we wanted to do the swim bait deal and we're still, we're not quitting on it. I know Andrew's going to keep at it. You can have those. <laughs> Andrew said I can have these. I bet I bust a couple over five out of them, mess. He might start talking a little different, but that's two really fast bites in a really small area. So I'm going to stay at this punching deal for a little while, see how that works out. <laughs> All right, another little one. Look, hold your swim bait up next to him. It's almost as big as what Andrew catches on every cast. Yeah. Yep. It's about the same size. <laughs> so hard to tell 
not. Like unwrapping a Christmas present. Thanksgiving, we unwrapping Christmas presents. Drew, look at that. Four and a half. Oh yeah. Four and a half. All right, first good, good solid fish of the day. Same thing again. Threw it in that mat. About the second time I popped it up, boy, he's there thumping it. So there it is, four and a half pounder. Another punching fish. We're busting them on a watermelon red, a little beaver style creature bait, and it's happening fast I got right a now. Fish on. You got it? Yeah, I don't know if I'm getting out of it. Oh no! Camera down! Camera down! I'm so sorry, GoPro. Another little, that's a little guy right there. Went back down in size a little bit, but you do this enough when they're biting it like this this fast, you're gonna run into some good ones up under this heavy cover. Another little chunky one on the punching. I think we got a real big one on here, boys. Man, hold right hold him, don't, don't force it too hard. Hold him. Got him, got him, got him. There we go, son. <laughs> that's uh, that's why I kept throwing the, the smash tag, Billy. That's why you thought that swim bait, son. About to have a hard time. <laughs> Get that right there. The smash tag convict. There it is. I told you guys, this guy's great with a swim bait in his hands. That's probably the one that broke our rod the other day. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Look yeah, at that thing, man. I'm gonna call that seven pounds. Yeah, that's absolutely. a good looking, beautiful fish. Nice yep. looking her. Let it go. So we're out here doing a day on the water segment and uh, Billy's smoking me with that punch rig. And uh, even got to the point that I tied one on and did it a few times but it didn't take me long to pick back up the smash tech convict and got a big one in the boat i think i'm gonna do it a little while longer did you guys see that holy oh right next to the tree yeah. oh yeah it is so the one two thing going uh you know i told you guys andrew's really good with the swim bait I don't want to say I'm really good at punching, but it's definitely one of my favorite things to do. I do I spend a lot of time doing it. And uh, we got a pretty good one-two punch going out here, don't we, bud? Yeah, you get them under the mat, I'll get them off the edge. Yeah, he, he's okay with that because he's going to catch the giant. Yeah, you catch the four-pounders, <laughs> I'll catch the eight-pounders. <laughs> that that's, sounds like a, a pretty good friend right there. <laughs> um, so, yeah, we're working. We're starting to get a pretty good bag going now. I've gotten this as a second one that's probably about three, three and a half. And, uh, well, that other one, no, that other one was bigger than four and a half. So I got a four and a half, a three and a half, and you got one seven. I'm not a math major, but that's like 15 pounds on three fish. So we got a pretty good combo going. We're going to keep at it. We're going for 25. Oh, yeah. Oh, big one? Yeah. He's big enough. I got him. Get in there, baby. There you go. <laughs> right, man, we got a little something going now. We got convict, it. Convict, convict and punching. Punch, convict yeah. With a punching rig. And... Good. Not, look at that thing right there. Yeah. Nice. That's a six right there. I'd say that's a solid six pounder, you think? Yeah. Yeah. I bet. Yeah. I bet. I bet. I bet. Boy, hell. we're at 21 on four. Yeah. We, our goal was 25. We're going to have to up the goal. <laughs> get 25 everything after that's great that's right buddy that's right outstanding good job brother <laughs> oh look how little he is I tried to show but look what I got you guys can tell from the background right now, we ain't budged. I mean, this is not even, is this even been a minute? I ain't no. been 60 seconds from the time he caught that swim bait fish. We got the one, two working on them, Drew. Of course, this is what I'm getting. <laughs> Drew's over here catching six, seven pounders. 
Nice little chunky fish. I know you'd be the guy to get. That's a you get him, that's a good one. That's a big wake he made. That's right with the cast I believe. Got him. What you got a big one? Yes. You got another big one, guys. Oh. Yeah, once you get it in them. That's another one. Look at that. There he comes. Oh, donkey. To... <laughs> Woo, look at that, buddy. I think we just hit 25. Oh. <laughs> look at that yeah, thing. Yeah, 25. That's that's at least a five. It's a five pounder for sure. Yeah. So that puts us right at 26. What's our smallest in that bag is a three and a half. So we got some cold room, dude. Yeah. Good fish. That is a fish. beautiful fish. That's Thank awesome. Thank you, Smash Tech. Thank you, Smash Tech. That's an awesome bait. Just to give you guys a brief rundown. The guy that makes these Smash Tech convicts. He's an East Texas guy. Uh, he lives real close to all these lakes up here that we fish. And uh, man, he's such an awesome guy. When you work with him and you get bait from him, you order from him. We'll get a pick of that. Yeah. He actually brought us two boxes full of baits this morning because we were running low. He shows up in the truck and hands us two boxes of baits. I mean, he's just a good dude. And you know, I like to buy local. And I'll tell you what, when you got a guy like that that's just good people, man, I love to do business with those guys. Yeah. Smash Tech Convict, quality bait made by a quality guy. And it just don't get no better than that right there. Throw it on the Convict. Number three on the Convict. Number three on the Convict. <laughs> Look this. It's like every time you catch a swim bait fish, I catch a like pound and a halfer. <laughs> I catch what he's trying to eat. <laughs> Another little chunky fish. He done got him another one on the convict. Look at that. Well, that gives us about a half a pound anyway. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, that's probably not much different. We'll stay at 26 where we are on that one. That's it looks good. three and a half pounder there. Pretty fish, pretty fish. No, the deal is. How about that? Come out here and throw and throw and not get a bite. But then you hit that sweet spot. That's it. I told you when we come in here, I told you when we started today, this is a special place, isn't it? This, this one, this one little spot, yeah, that's a big one. Come on. He's not that big, but he's that. <laughs> he got some weight to him. Oh, he's a little bit longer than he looks. Oh, sloppy, paddy grass. <laughs> I'd say that. What do you call that? Five? Yeah, yeah, he's five pounds. Twenty-seven and a half, baby. There we are. Yeah, that, beautiful that hook fish. Just fell out of him. With all that junk. Nice. Bring him through all that cover. It's hard. That's a beautiful fish. Beautiful fish. Convict. Smash tag, baby. I know what you're doing to me. I know what game you're playing, Andrew Grill. Oh, I, I don't like it. <laughs> I got him that time. He ain't that big. Either. No, he ain't that big. He finally got that swim bait. Look at him. Boy, he choked it that time. It's all the way in his mouth. Yeah, he wanted it that time. <laughs> oh, my God. Look at this. He choked it. <laughs> Three pounder. Eat that swim bait like that. Yeah. Oh, he feels good. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm tired. We played that one out. I think we're going to throw the convict today. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I finally threw the convict enough to get bit on it, and you see what it did for me. What do you call that one? Oh, uh, yeah, that's five pounder, right? Five and a half? Yeah, I, he feels more. I think, yeah, five, we'll go five and a half. Um, but you notice you was alone on the deck when you got him. Like <laughs> <laughs> you got to be quick with Andrew. If you don't get him while he's down in the bottom of the boat, he ain't going to leave nothing for you. He's like a vacuum cleaner, man. He just sucks them all up. Five and a half, that gives us another pound. That puts us at 28 and a half. That's All pretty right. good. Yeah, man. This is a good fish right here. Let me give her a drink and give me a picture, bud. Ooh. Oh, he's got one. We got doubles. You need help or you got him? 
Oh, he come off. Yo, he come off. Get a picture of him? No, I bet. <laughs> we'll see how long it takes him to put down that puncher and pick the combat back there. Same hole. I mean, look, I told him again. Same fish, huh? Same fish. <laughs> <laughs> That's not bad, fish. Okay. Not really wanting to bite right now. We're kind of having them having really soak that thing in there, soak it up and down to get bites. And man, they're not getting it real good. It's nothing like it was earlier. It's kind of shut down. Our wind kind of slowed down. Feels like it's picking up a little bit again, though. We're starting to hit, hear a couple more blocks, so maybe they'll turn back on here real quick. Fair <laughs> he's not that big, huh? He's pretty good, but he's not as big as he's actually. Yeah. I don't think that one's gonna help us. <laughs> oh. Huh? <laughs> Pretty close to be probably four and three quarters. But we need six and a half. Well, we need anything over five would help us. I don't think he's over five. Sweet. They kind of slowed down for a little while in that convict, didn't they, Drew? Yeah, they did. Uh, the wind started blowing again. Uh, you know, so I, I, I kept chunking it. And when, when we started to get some more wind, a little more activity, you know, that's when we got, I've had three bites in the last four casts, I think. Uh, might have been the same fish. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, anyway. That's another good one. That's a pretty good day when he can't make your best five. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah absolutely. Line wrapped all around him and everything. He, he doesn't look that big, but he's, he's heavy. He's Boy, this, he's this is just such a perfect situation to really target bigger fish for that convict. Because there's nothing else that you could go after these fish with. I mean, you could go through here and flip and frog, and you could catch fish, and you might catch some of these. But to catch the numbers that we have, especially you have today, in, in this kind of cover, there's really nothing else you can do it with. It's a special, special deal. Right, and, and he's, he's not a giant. You know what I mean? Everybody thinks back home, wherever they're from, that they don't bite big baits like that. But yeah. yeah, yeah. You know, I grew up in Kentucky, and I, I fished a swim bait a long time before I moved to Texas. Right. And uh, they bite big swim baits anywhere, anywhere there's bass and semi-clear water. There's going to be a little bit of a swim bait bite. Andrew's got him a lot of cover, so he may not be real big. But Andrew said he's a big one, and Andrew's usually pretty right. <laughs> He's pretty doggone good. I well, think that's our six pounder right there. Yeah, yeah, boy, he, yeah, he's got some heavy, heavy to him. Heavy fish. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had to go through so much to get one out of, out of stuff. Man. So I hope you guys enjoyed this day on the water. It was a special day for me. I think this is our biggest bag to date on our day on the water series so far. And I told you guys it was going to get better soon, and it's getting better quick now, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It's that fall time. They're turning that feed bag on. It's crazy action. You know, we got these fish that feed on big gizzard shed. We're catching them on big swim baits. That's a whole lot of fun. That's going to continue for a little while. And we're getting that cold water time of year. Yeah. That's good too. Yeah, man. That's what I live for. We're going to go ahead and get this fish in the water. Say bye, fish. Later, guys. That wraps up this day on the water. I think it was a pretty good one. What do you think? Pretty good. Pretty good. It's hard to beat that. You know, I know we both are missing our families. But if we couldn't be with them, I couldn't think of a much better way to do it than to come out here and jack some fish like that. It was the next best thing, that's for sure. <laughs> it was awesome. Andrew, that was an awesome job. Andrew busted him on that swim bait. I told you guys, this guy's for real on the big baits. It's, it's something he loves to do. He does it a lot. He's really, really good at it. I got to do something I love to do, which is punching mats. Yeah. Caught a couple of decent ones out of there. Not you like schooled me on the punching deal, though. I mean, yeah. You had me wanting to punch a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> not for long once they yeah. bit that big bait, though. Yeah. But you know what? You know, we really had a deal going. I wish I could have got to catching some big fish under the mats. We would have really had something then. Yeah. Can always be a little bit better. But you know what? We have no regret. We can't ask for much more than what we got today. No. Good day. Good day. You guys, stay tuned to this channel. Your Lake Fork Guide. This guy right here, he's going to be coming on here every once in a while. We got big things coming next year. We'll let you know about here pretty soon. So y'all stay tuned. 
if you like that video hit that thumbs up if you want to see more like it hit the subscribe button and uh stay tuned to your lake for a guy that's about all i got you got anything else my brother that's it let's go eat go I'm wildcats <laughs> and get some turkey see y'all later appreciate it